My name's Matthew Postlethwaite. My name's Geoffrey Postlethwaite. And we're the Postlethwaite Twins. We've always been interested in doing something entertainment along the lines of whether it be uh, acting or Rapping, going into rap, singing, <laughs> hip hop. <laughs> <laughs> um, we actually, when we were about 12, 13, um, we auditioned uh, for S Club Juniors and we got into the top 50 of that. I don't so. want to say that. <laughs> <laughs> so that was kind of like the initial start of uh, maybe we could progress. It was a case of getting a showreel together um, to try and basically sell ourselves um, to what we can do as actors basically. So we did a lot of student films, a lot, a lot of short films. We did quite a few individually because we are quite different actors, um, yeah. but we do team up to play the occasional twin role. Then it was a case of we got this audition um, and it was for a BBC drama. I met with the director, did the audition. He asked us to do a Birmingham accent, which was quite funny. I didn't, I didn't think the audition actually went that well. No, it didn't. No. He must have seen something, though. Yeah. We, so we got cast in this TV show called Peaky Blinders on BBC Two. Nipper and Henry. And it was a fantastic experience. We've finished, we filmed the first series, and we've just done the second series. It's just been aired. The uh, commercials that uh, we've been in is you've done uh, CSL Hell's Kitchen. Yeah. We've both done uh, Your Grey, which is a watch commercial. It uh, was it was a great commercial because the the casting was for twenty five plus year olds, and obviously we're not that old. Um, so they put a lot of <laughs> make, <laughs> put loads of makeup on us to make us look older, um, and that was, was kind, kind of almost it was plastered on our face. It was. So this short film that we did is called Blood and there's kind of this triangle within it where there's us two obviously and it's all kind of centred around the girl. It gets a little bit heated um, and the kind of storyline progresses. Out of over 600 films it got nominated uh, for an award, it got long listed to the top 36 films for an award, uh, Triforce Short Film Festival. It's a great film festival, it's kind of just up and coming but it's, it, got it's just been held up after this year um, so we got to go down some great films over there yeah. so we've had our London agent for about a year and a half now and we've decided to go to LA for pilot season yeah so we've been arranging a few meetings with some managers our current agent Dan London has been arranging some and the idea is to go out to get signed within the first week. We have got loads of meetings planned. We do. And we've, we've got a deadline as well. The Friday of the week we get there, we need to know exactly who we want to go for. So we've got our three year uh, acting visa. The, the plan is to kind of stay there as long as possible. I think we've got kind of enough money to last us about four months. I think it's about six months that we'll be able to stay out for. Yeah. if we're very careful with our money. Our parents have always said that you have, you have a long time working, so make sure it's something that you enjoy, make sure uh, it's something that you want to do for the rest of your life. The kind of best thing that they have done is kind of not stopped us from doing anything that we kind of want to do. So if we say we want to kind of, I want to be an astronaut, I'm sure they'll, I mean, they, they wouldn't know how to become an astronaut, but they'd support it. Yeah, they would. The best piece of advice that I'd probably pass on, and we are, as I said, quite relatively new, but the thing that I find that really helps me is kind of just that same thing of being real, being present, and kind of just being there in that moment and feeling every single thing that that person or that character would feel. The amount of times that we talk to people and they're kind of looking away or kind of seeing who's going to come in the room or and I think you kind of make such a stronger connection if you kind of just look at people directly in the eye and just kind of be there even if you're only talking to them for a minute it's such, so much more powerful than kind of talking to them for maybe 10 minutes but not really engaging. If you want to start something new that you've never done before 
uh, you, need, you need to gain, gain the knowledge behind it. So like do your research, like do, do your reading, then from that knowledge you'll gain your passion. Then from the passion you need to really direct your focus and anything in life, you, it needs to be focused but you need to be passionate about it. And if you do them things, you need to be brave, you need to go for it. Like you've only, you've only got one life but you'll have thousands of opportunities. So one might fail, get up and do the next one, that's what I say. We'll let you know how it works out in like six months. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we are still young to the industry and we will be so new when we go out to LA. So we're just yeah. really excited, excited for the future. Like we are still brand new. We're gonna give it a go and see what happens and that's really all that we can do and kind of just enjoy the whole process and the whole experience. Yeah, try and enjoy it for a second, yeah. And, yeah. and see what comes from it. Yeah. Thank you very much for watching. If you are interested in following our journey, please follow these links.